Hi, this is Patrick Everson for Covers.com, coming to you from the home office here in Las Vegas on a Sunday afternoon, just a few hours after a noteworthy trade in the NFL. The Atlanta Falcons send star wideout Julio Jones to the Tennessee Titans. What's that mean for Super Bowl futures odds? Well, I discussed just that with Nick Bogdanovich behind the counter at William Hill U.S., and Nick said, honestly, doesn't mean a whole lot. He was really nonplussed by this move when the news first broke earlier today. He said, I think it means absolutely nothing. No changes is basically the answer. Nick said, when is the last time Jones played 16 games in a season? I'm a big Julio Jones fan, he said. I think he's fantastic. But when the body goes, the body goes. The bottom line is he's an old receiver with health issues. So that said, initially William Hill US did not make any adjustments, kept the Titans at 40 to one, kept the Falcons at 75 to one. Didn't shorten the Titans, didn't lengthen the Falcons. Now other books did react very quickly and some very strongly. Bet MGM went from 40 to one on the Titans all the way to 25 to one. And on the Falcons went from 75, actually from 80 to one, I should say, to 100 to one. Points Bet USA also made a modest move. They went from 35 to one to 30 to one on the Tennessee Titans. Now, ultimately, after a couple of hours and seeing some action on the Titans at 40 to one, that's when Nick Bogdanovich acceded a little bit and moved the Titans into 30 to one from that 40 to one price. For my complete update on Super Bowl odds and action, head over to covers.com and of course, give us a follow on Twitter at covers.